With a yo ho ho, it's Taylor the Toaster. Welcome back to Let's Play Inazuma 11 to Firestorm. In the last video, we learned about Royal Academy Redux and explored Ahime. In this particular video, we are headed for the docks. Ooh, ominous. Jude? What do you think? We've got to go in. Hmm. First place in the game that doesn't immediately think, make you think, Oh, it's pretty! More, Oh, it's scary this time. These must be the docks where Oswald saw the sea monster. It's too quiet. Look at all the crows. I've got a bad feeling about this place. I can't see anything out of the ordinary here. Apart from the weather, it's taken a dramatic turn from when we were in Ahime. Whoa! Muffled to the ground by a certain gruff man. To be honest, I thought it was going to be Detective Smith, but it's Coach Hillman. What were you thinking running in here like that? Hey. Look over there. I mean, I can't see because of this building. Oh, good grief. That's a lot of guards. The whole place is crawling with alias guards. That was close. We would have run right into them. Well, oh, those guards can only mean one thing. Royal Academy Redux must be somewhere nearby. That's what I thought. But I've been over every inch of these docks. And I can't find a trace of the place. I even found a boy who'd escaped, but he couldn't tell me where it was. So the gruff old man who hoped Oswald was Coach Hillman. We should have known from the description. No, because as I said, I thought it was Detective Smith. But it's even possible he was planning this before he was arrested. And if he wrote down any of his plans, there's only one place they'd be. In, in the police car, I would think. No, we're gonna head to Royal Academy to look for clues on where the secret Royal Academy Redux headquarters could be. I have no idea what happened to everyone from Royal Academy since I transferred to Ryman. Maybe they all hate me. But at least we can go there where... I've, I've been waiting to go to Royal Academy for a while, actually, because one of the uh, extra competition route matches has been waiting there this entire time. This was for speed, wasn't it? I, I, I don't take the time to read these. But... L that's, that doesn't seem good. That does indeed raise speed somehow. I guess we'll, we'll give one to Janus. We want to bump him up in every way imaginable. I mean, jumping off a building, snapping the rope, landing in the water, getting noticed by the guards. None of this seems positive to me. But yeah, we can't go beyond Coach Hillman. So instead we need to go to Royal Academy. I'll have a quick heal up. The match in the extra competition route will mostly happen off screen as usual. We're going to stick to the main content. We had Tokyo, which is where Ryman is indeed situated. Royal Academy. But even though Ryman is in Tokyo, it's still specified to be a town in Tokyo, so not too suburban. Stop right there, this is Royal Academy. No trespasses! Well, you're just quite stupid, aren't you? You do know who I am. Sorry to have not recognised your immediately recognisable face, or goggles, and stupid haircut. You can take your friends with you as well, and you can even steal everything that's in our treasure chest that we were trying to save for a rainy day. That's a good move, Dark Whirlwind. That's a, a blocking move with evil ambiance. And that Jude is with some of those Prime and Eleven kids. What's he doing back here? I thought he was too good for Royal Academy. 
I have super sharp hearing despite my very long locks. Bloom, Trent, master! I don't see you as my master, though. Yeah, Royal Academy Redux, there's something I need to ask you. Did Dark leave anything behind that might give us a clue as to what he's planning? Any little thing might be important. I thought you might ask that. You did? Sorry, but it looks like when Dark left, he took all his papers with him. We started our own investigation when we heard about the rumors of Royal Academy Redux. But we've lost contact with Sanford and King. They were following a lead down in Ahime. What? Why didn't you tell me sooner? Well... You know what Dark is capable of. If he's taken them prisoner, there's no telling what he might do to them. Calm down, Jude. I'm sure they just didn't want to worry you. I'm sorry. We should have told you straight away. No, I'm sorry for losing my temper. Hey, Sharp, what do you think you're doing back there? More team members. I, I joined the Royal Academy because of you. I wanted to become a genius midfielder just like you. But then you abandoned the team when they lost. How do you think it feels for us watching you grab all the glory with Ryman? I knock it off. Jude's kind of like that. He did. Whoa, where did you come from? What a massive traitor. That kind of scared me. I was even mid-sentence. The blazes are you. Hmm. Thought I'd shut my mouth and stay out of it if I were you, pal. This is grown-up talk. That uniform. You're from Redux. Even though I've never met anyone from Redux and I somehow recognize the uniform. Yes, indeed. You're now in the presence of Royal Academy Redux's captain. The one... The only Caleb Stonewall. What? He's their captain. He's too evil. And very scary. What were they thinking with that face? Oh, well, Joseph and R Samford, we were just talking about you. <laughs> oh, what a touching reunion. Joe, Dave, what's going on? What are you doing with Redux? You're not but with Dark, are you? Don't be ridiculous. They would never choose to go back to Dark. Who asked you, Goggle Boy? Didn't you hear them? They hate your guts. That's right, eh, boys? You hate nasty old Jude for abandoning you, don't you? Poor boys. Poor, poor boys. He's wrong. I didn't abandon any of you. Even though he specifically said in his dialogue he lost to Zeus, so he joined Royal Acad Ryman for a chance to get back at that very team. He used Ryman completely, and yet now he's just a mate, and he's not a traitor at all. You have no idea how hard it was for us, lying there in hospital after Zeus destroyed us. You were out there winning matches with your new Ryman friends. Without us, do you know how that felt? You got the rush of victory, and we were all left with just the bitterness of defeat. Don't say that. When Jude helped us beat Zeus, he did it for you. Well, no, he did it for himself, but you know, let's stick up for him. <laughs> I don't believe it. The great Jude Sharp is actually apologizing. Forgive me. I just didn't stop to think about you. I went ahead and did what I wanted. I will apologize as many times as you want, and as many ways as you want, but please, don't go back to dark. Oh, look at you, you're pathetic! Ah, Jude! Me! <laughs> Stay out of it. This is between me and them. Ah, Jude! Ah, feels like my head's gonna burst. Joseph, run, Jude, get out of here. You don't stand a chance if you take him on now. He's going to make us use that special move. Shut it, you. He's not afraid to hit people. I am terrified of this Stonewall lad who's brainwashed these guys. 
They wanted to become stronger. They wanted to get even with their backstabbing captain. All I did was give their feelings a nudge in the right direction. And by a nudge, I mean a, a pretty hard-hitting punch. You were always one step ahead of us. Always the genius playmaker. And I always was just doing my best to keep up with you. And I wanted to feel what it was like to be you. What it was like to have everything. Sanford. That feeling just kept on building up inside me. Until I would have done anything to have a taste of your power. Even if it meant going back to Ray Dark. How could you exploit their feelings like that? What's wrong with you? Ugh. Boss. What is it? Make it quick. Things are getting interesting round here. Stonewall is a curious combination of like iron side and wall side on our team. We even have another wall to be dealing with now. Well, gents, now we've all been introduced. How about we settle this back at Royal Academy Redux? Pop down to the docks in Ahime. You can't miss us. We'll be waiting for you, Mr. X Captain. <laughs> right, come on, you lot. Let's get out of this dump. Yes, Caleb. Perfect name choice, Caleb. Caleb is just. Oh, everything about that name makes me think rebel. Sorry if I do have a viewer called Caleb. That doesn't mean I dislike the name Caleb. It just makes me think rebel, person with hatred toward the world. A guy exactly like Caleb Stonewall. But a manual for a stolen move has been stolen from the archive at Royal Academy and that's bad news. Jude is trying to cover it up but trust me, it's bad. That special move must not be used. We're going to head back to the Hime docks, report to Coach Hillman and see where to go from there. Except not because we cannot play a match with them. Well, I guess that makes sense. Yes, Royal is next on the extra competition route, but we can't fight them yet. Hey! Uh-oh, the coach is surrounded by guards. Off you run, quickly. Okay, that, that random bystander just got away. Or was that Oswald? You lot got here in the nick of time. Now that you, before I sent you away from the guards, but now I want you to confront the guards. It's, it's, a, it's a complete... Roll reversal. You aren't okay. Oh yes. Hey, you guys are. We made it in time. We're here to help you. Bobby. Seems you're having a spot of bother. Planning on running headlong into the enemy as usual, are you? Some things never change. Warden, Swing, good to see you. Sorry, Jude. We only just heard from Bloom that you'd be heading here. We came running as soon as we got the word. We can chat about it later. Let's teach these knuckleheads a lesson first. So you very much must remember back in part four that I said if you don't get Bobby at the start of the game, you will eventually get him in the form of an exclusive cutscene that you would not see otherwise. And that is Bobby's one. Eric will come later, but Bobby's come to help us out with the mass attack of guards. But these alias guys must, of course, fall at the hands of alias. Something I must point out, Janus's Astro Break uses only 20 TP. Generally, the amount of TP is indicative of a move's power, but that's not the case with any move used by an alias player. Alias players' moves cost half the amount of TP to their power, so it's a 40 power move, but it costs half that amount to use, so... Alias players, very useful. Well, well, it seems like you got rid of the guards for now. And we also got Bobby on the team. Now don't fly yourselves. 
We didn't do it for you. We're just worried about Joe and Dave. So, didn't that boy with the weird hair say that Redux was somewhere around here? But can we really trust what that kid says? Around here, I've searched all over these docks and I haven't seen anything. Obviously, Bobby will be quite underleveled. So, and and he got his spotlight in the first dinner zoom. I'm not actually going to be using him on the team. Otherwise, I probably would have got him right at the start. But investigating the docks more closely, two separate clickable squares. The captain of Reno said it would be somewhere around here. Could the entrance to Royal Academy Redox really be here? Uh, uh, what? Uh, There's no school here. You're not wrong. No, uh, but, but oh, how? Oh. Alias Academy has allowed us to rise from the ashes. Yes, and our name is Royal Academy Redux. Redux. Yes indeed, where to hide a secret base, underwater of course, they maybe could have suspected that given that we knew it was going to be at the docks, and I don't think it, a submarine should really get that much airtime when submerging out of the water, but yes, Royal Academy Redux are situated on a submarine. Some people never listen, typical. I don't know how many lines of dialogue Bobby's going to get throughout the rest of the game, but he's definitely getting some spotlight in here, because of course he needs to join us. We don't get a choice in the matter. I think he's even a key player that we're not allowed to release. Sure, you used to play on the same team as Sanford and King, didn't you? I am still on their team. Are you indeed? Come on, Jude, we've got to stop Dark and save your friends. Be careful. We don't know what Dark has in store for us. Yeah, I think we may need to save the match for an episode, another episode to prepare. So we're getting on this thing. Ha! <laughs> I'd be lying if I said hanging out with you lot were boring. All aboard! Let's do this. David, Joseph, we'll have you out of there in no time. I believe in you, Mark. There's no way you let Dark beat you now. So why do I feel nervous about this? I've got a sneaking feeling something awful is going to happen. 